What's up, you guys? Welcome back to another SnowRunner video here on the channel. Now, today we're actually going to be testing out the Truck Night in America map here. Now, we got a few trucks that we're going to be trying out. The F-250 we have there. We got the 79 K-30, and then we also have a Harley Davidson. I know it sounds crazy, but we are going to be taking a Harley through the Truck Night in America. Now, I don't know how far we're going to make it. Um, I've done the Truck Night in America on Offered Outlaws. But I have not done it on SnowRunner. So we're going to give that a shot. Now, I think the truck that we're going to drive first for this little challenge, I guess you could say, is going to be the F-250. Just because, you know, I feel like the tires on the K-30 and all, like, the lift and everything is really going to help it do probably better than the F-250 and, of course, the uh, Harley-Davidson there. So, uh, yeah, we're going to save the best for last here. And I think what we're going to do is do the F-250. Then we're going to do the, you know what, we may do the K-30 and then the Harley. Because the Harley is just going to be crazy. It's going to be a wild experience. So we may just save that for last. But anyway, we're going to go ahead and jump in the F-250 right now and get headed out here and see what we can make happen. Let's go ahead and release that e-brake. And here we go, guys. I probably need to shut off the K-30 real quick just so we don't have that thing just sitting here running and wasting fuel. So let's do that real quick. All right, so here we go, guys. We are about to attempt the truck night in america and we're currently in like two-wheel drive right now i don't know if that's a bad idea um yeah let's go ahead and lock her in four-wheel drive there oh and we got some mud coming up oh my goodness oh well it's actually doing pretty good i guess this is kind of a test oh no oh no we may be in trouble here let's see we gotta throw her in low it, it's it's making it somewhat oh man yep it, it's crawling out it was struggling there for a little bit and then uh i just put it in low and now it seems like it's doing pretty good Okay, I, honestly, I'm just curious as to what all this map has on it. Because, like I said, I've never played it in SnowRunner here. So, this is going to be a fun experience. Man, that, that, was, uh, that was pretty deep right there. That was. So, let's go ahead and put this back in auto. Then go to high here. Oh, my goodness. Oh, we, we may have tore up some stuff just then. Yep, we may have. Oh, no. Big jump right there. Dangerous water level. Oh, man. Come on. Come on, F-250. It's throwing low. There we go. Low did the job. Low did the job. Oh, this is kind of like a little rock crawling terrain area. Oh, no. You guys, um, those trucks right there really let me know that, oh, yeah, our truck that we have driving over this is currently not the right one. We need like a mega truck, honestly. It's funny because I actually did download that mod, like a mega truck mod just for this, but I couldn't find it. It wasn't showing up, so that's why we are not using that. Okay, yeah, we, we don't have what it takes to climb over those trucks, so we're just going to skip that a little obstacle. Um, let's see. We're going to cruise around and bounce around through here. Looks good. Uh-oh. Man, this is, uh, this is definitely getting interesting. I feel like this is getting harder as we go on. Oh, man. Yelp. Engine stalling. Oh, no. Engine is broken. Oh, man. Well... Uh, yeah, the engine is not going to do anything. Well, this is as far as the F-250 has made it. Um, I know I can definitely repair the engine right now and probably be okay. But, you know, we're, we're going to keep this somewhat realistic and we're going to just leave it here. So this is how far this truck made it. Now we're going to jump in the K-30 and see what happens. All right, guys, here we are in the K-30. And, man, um, we definitely have a bigger lift here on the K-30. And I think the tires are going to help us a little bit more. I don't know how far we're going to make it. You know, uh, we kind of messed up the F-250 there when we jumped. I don't know if that had anything to do with it or it was just the water. But, yeah, we're about to find out. Man, the K-30 is actually rolling pretty good through here. We may need to drop it down in auto. We'll just do that. Okay, okay. Well, this is going a lot better than it did with the F-250. Um, we can go ahead and lock the diff in. Okay, okay. She's crawling out. She's crawling out. There we go. That's good. Oh, man. Yep. Turn on the headlights there. We got to have the headlights on. It looks like it's kind of getting dark out here too. All right, there we go. See, maybe we can go to high right there. All right, all right. We're just going to crawl easily over this. Okay, we need a mega truck, you guys. I think that's what we're going to do next. We can bring like a mega truck out here and test everything out. Uh-oh. Let's uh, not stall the engine too bad there. Here we go. Dangerous water level. Yes, we know, but we don't care. We're still going to crawl over this. Oh, man. I love how the rocks actually move when you drive over them. That is so neat. You know, we could try to crawl over the uh, little Chevy here. Okay, yeah, we just pushed it out of the way. <laughs> we just pushed it out of the way, and then uh, we're high-centered on this rail now. Oh, that was a bad idea. Okay, well, we made it off. Man, those lights are definitely coming in handy here. 
Oh, man, dangerous water level. Okay, our motor seems to be doing pretty good. Everything else seems to be okay. Yeah, we don't really have any damage to anything else other than really like a little bit, I think, to the suspension right there. And then a little bit to the motor. Uh-oh. You know what? It's only fair, guys, if we ramp into this just like we did with the F-250. So it's only fair if we ramp into it. So here we go. Let's go ahead and back up. All right. Now, I think the F-250, we come out of here, and then we just sent it, man. And that's when everything went downhill. So let's go ahead and put this in high. So let's go ahead and put this in automatic, and let's swap to high real quick. Here we go. Here we go. This is kind of what we did. Oh, the, the K-30 is not as fast. Yeah, we took a lot of damage right there. But, hey, we are making it. Uh-oh. The K-30 is taking water damage. In high, this thing is chugging through here, man. Oh, no. Throw it in low. Okay. Man, the K-30 has made it further than the F-250. This is insane. This is kind of like, this is not the trucks you want to bring to truck night in America. But, I mean, everything's going somewhat good. Let's see. Uh, let's back up here. All right, here we go. We're going to navigate to this right side over here. And we actually crawl through. We're doing some rock crawling with the K-30. It's not really set up for this. But, I mean, it's doing it. We're attempting it. Uh, that's all that matters. Uh-oh, man, this thing is rock crawling like crazy right now. It's getting late out here. It's dark, but we're not giving up. We're going to stick with it. Oh, my goodness. We're actually doing so, so good right now. This truck is doing amazing. Let's go ahead and drop it in auto there. Oh, we got a nice little climb here. I think the K30, yes, it can. It can handle it. Let's go. All right, okay, so now we got like a little obstacle course here. All right, so just kind of crawl over this. Nice and steady, nice and steady here. Oh, so we got some flex right there. Flex out of the K30. No, we don't want to fall over. We don't want to fall over. All right, well, guys, uh, we're going to have to winch out of here. That's all we're able to do right now. So let's go ahead and attach this winch to about right there. Okay, so I see a lot of winch points that we have. Um, let's see. I'm kind of wanting to use, you know, well, no, that's going to pull us to the side. You know what? Maybe we could just use that one. Here we go. I, th I think that's going to pull us somewhat of the way. All right, so here we go. We're winching out right now. We got high centered, but hey, that doesn't matter. We're still going to make it. Oh, no. Oh, no. Um, that's not good. No, man. We lost the K30 here. And we made it pretty far. Um, we were almost to the end, I think. I think I see the end down there. Um, I think we can winch out. Yeah, we can. We can winch out. Um, yeah, that's insane, man. Oh, my goodness. How far can the K30 make it here? Yep, the K30 has made it to about right here, the poor K30, man. All right, so now the last thing that we're going to be testing is the Harley-Davidson. So let's go hop in the Harley-Davidson. Uh, yeah, let's do that. Let's go ahead and go back right here, go to the Harley, and we're going to attempt to drive that thing for a little ways. I don't feel like it's going to go very far at all, but yeah, we're, we're going to attempt it. Can you, uh, you, so you can put on diff lock when it's in low. Okay. All right, so I don't know what's going to help us here. I think possibly, uh, oh my goodness, this thing is hard to control. I think just being able to go fast is actually going to help us. I don't know. This thing is very hard to control. Oh, man, especially in the mud here. Oh, goodness. No way we're actually making it. No way we're actually making it in the Harley. There, this is insane. Okay, yep. It's actually going a little better, but I'm actually uh, choosing an easier way through here. So, yeah. <laughs> That could, that could be a factor in that. Alright, we're going to drop her in low and lock the diff in. I don't know what that does, but uh, yeah, it's, uh, we're going to attempt to see what it does. Oh man, dangerous water level. That's the only thing. The Harley is very low to the ground, so I feel like it's going to take water damage pretty much no matter what. Uh-oh. Okay, yeah, still a dangerous water level right there. Man, the Harley's actually surprising me, you guys. It's actually surprising me. I didn't think it was going to make it this far through here if we're being honest especially when we hit that first little mud hole just then i just knew that yep that, that was a wrap oh we're actually making it up though we're actually making it up you guys what if the harley makes it further than the f-250 that, that's gonna be uh quite the sight there uh oh let's go ahead and lock it in low throw it in low here lock the diff oh no we may be in trouble here wait 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 we gotta carefully maneuver this Harley that is not meant to even be near Truck Night in America through this obstacle course. Okay, it doesn't like that. So what if we go around? 
Okay, hey, 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 who says we can't go around if we need to? Alright, throw it back in auto there. Okay, we're good, we're good. Alright, everything's going good. We got a little rock crawling coming up. Don't know how that's gonna go. Oh my gosh, we're out here mudding in SnowRunner with a Harley. Who would have ever guessed it? Oh no, water level is dangerous. Oh, we just took our first little bit of damage to the engine there. Let's see. I'm surprised that's like our first little bit of damage, though, if we're being honest. Man, this thing's actually doing really good through here. Way better than I ever thought it would. Okay, okay. Alright, alright. This is uh, getting kind of hard to control here. Oh, we got some speed going now. I don't know if speed's going to help us or hurt us in this situation, but we're going to send it and we're going to find out, I guess. Okay, you guys, where did the F-250 stop at? Where did it stop? I think it was like right up here. Let's go ahead and lock that diff in there. Come on, come on. Alright, so we got the diff locked in. Let's see, we're going to throw it back in, I guess, auto. Oh, no. Go ahead and lock that in. We got the diff locked in. Oh, no. Is this it for the Harley Davidson? No, it's not. And we make it out with ease. Let's go. One more here. Dangerous water level. Oh, we're not taking any damage to the engine, though. So we're still good. We are still good. All right, so let's go ahead and take that off right there. Go ahead and put it back in auto. And here we go. So we're in like third gear, I think. Yes. Oh, no, there's the F-250. No, we, we sent it to us. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, this may be it. Uh-oh. Yep. Oh, no, the Harley made it as far as the F-250. That's insane. Oh my gosh, man. Look, hey, the headlights still work underwater. Yep, that, that's uh, that's always good. So um, I think we're going to have to either get a truck to go save these or just leave them. Not sure here, but this is, gonna, this is crazy, man. I cannot believe that the Harley, did it technically make it further than the, let's see. No, it did not. It did not make, you can kind of see it a little bit there underwater. We didn't necessarily make it all the way out, but hey, we made it a pretty good ways. That's insane. I'm surprised we made it as far as we did. That just blows my mind. Let's see. Should we? Let's see. Maybe change trucks. Um, We could hop in the F-250 right there. All right. As you guys can see, we managed to recover all the vehicles, and we have them sitting right here. We're about to get ready for our thumbnail, but we're going to go ahead and get out of here. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye, guys. Thanks for watching.